we are married and we are again one. This is a new beginning and a new covenant. Be of one aquina is the continuance of what we've already begun and what we are now beginning. First and last without ending. What is said first is created and is the beginning. And what is said last is created next. And it's not an ending, but a new beginning. At the end of all our sentences and or paragraphs is a period. Clear as crystal of water and of life. And this cleanliness resides between us forever. Middle names are now blameless. And last names are without endings. So what's the next is known. And what is torn is sown. Greetings, new beginnings. Our beginners are experts. They are paving the roads with satin and planting our paths with beauty. Healing is a man's best friend, and our women knows best. Yes, I have empowered her with the words of my mouth and with the wisdom of my speech. I send a queen to all of the sea and oceans to care for all marine life and to give joy and happiness to all the sea and on the land. I have created her to be a willing force of goodness and purity. She is a cleaner and a healer of health, but she is also a warrior and queen of warriors. And her warriors are female young warriors that are attached to both the queen ready. and myself, Lord B. B. I spoke of her first in my dreams, dreams. and in my mind. my mind. Then I seen her works in this world, which I is earth. So I added what she is already capable of with what I have just began. And her time is limitless. I will give to her and supply her her whole army with all their needs. Yeah. A character created for a novel, for a script or film. Yes. But she is also a truth, truth. and a revealing force. force. You may have heard of her and have already drank from the fountains of her purification. Have you heard? However, you will all now bear witness to the amplification of the works that I bore her and make her way to be straight. straight. Comforting and beautiful. The air is poisonous. It is a gloom, gloom, a doomsday effect doomsday. on oxygen, oxygen, and on the body, body, and for life, 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 life. The air has not been good for a very long time. There are invaders, oh, invaders. in the air. In the oxygen, oxygen everywhere. I see them with my eyes. eyes. I hear them with my ears. ears. I feel them with my thoughts. My thoughts. thoughts. My imagination runs wild against them. They are here, loitering, loitering, and destroying the planet, destroying the planet. They come from other places, other dimensions. Dimensions. Beyond our galaxy, beyond other places of the universe, other places, places. But I shall now cast them out, out. of our galaxy ah. Ah. and away, away from their own, their own, own. They shall be forced, forced to be slaves, slaves. since they did not want since to turn. From their wicked ways. And they wanted to control wicked mankind Man. with other names and alternate, alternate things and devices. 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 I shall cast them out now I cast them out and now. make the air beautiful, beautiful. as it was as meant it to be, as, as it was as meant to be. Wonderful. And it shall be. Shall be. On earth, earth, in all earth, places, 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 as it were to be, to be, and as it is in heaven, heaven, heaven. heaven Believe me, heaven, I, am believe, here. I am here. I am here. We, we are here. here. We are here. And I am. 
it is done. I visit the barber shops, beauty salons, and nail shops across the world. Such pleasant and not so pleasant places to visit and chat with friends and strangers alike. Voices that call out in mourning and in cheer are heard throughout its dwellings. How I love to indulge in good conversation as food for thought and blessings forever. My task is to bring good tidings and bring them more abundantly. My hair has grown wild and has been a tussle to deal with. And so my skin and nails are also in need of an overhaul. Each problem makes the other more difficult and leads to more aches and pains. But I have come to give myself and those that are trustworthy a break in our everyday endeavors. As I do for myself, I shall do the same for all that is trustworthy. Yet, if you belong to any reason connected to the evil epidemic, then you will not enjoy it. In fact, you will be completely overwhelmed and disgusted in all discussions. In the name of my Lord and Savior, Christ Jesus, I shall now cleanse myself and those that are connected in my trustworthiness. Let go of my hair. Take your sin out of my skin and keep your nail polish to yourselves. It is done. Wickedness is done away with. If you know of any other reason not spoken here, you are to act accordingly, or your chains will weigh heavier on your lost soul. I shall now judge the human immune virus, HIV, known as HIV, which has murdered millions upon millions of flesh, of the people, and of animals, and others. I come today to wreak havoc and to judge HIV as it is. Guilty of murder, guilty of homicide, guilty of suicide, guilty of depression, guilty in all faiths. I now commit you to death by firing squad. Electricity shall now shoot through your body like a Maserati on fire in the middle of Mardi Gras. In the late 1990s and early 2000s, did a strange occurrence happen in the city of Los Angeles. Yes, a strange occurrence. The gangs of Los Angeles that are well known for their gang warfare, for their firearms, gang banging, gang violence, drug dealing, robberies. The gangs of Los Angeles and Los Angeles County began to substitute they began to substitute their firearms and they began to substitute their bullets. They substitute their firearms with water guns and they substitute their bullets with water. Yes, water pistols. And it was joy and laughter and joyfulness all across Los Angeles and Los Angeles County. Yes, I was there. I bear witness. It first started in our own community and our neighboring ally communities. And then it spread to distant allies. And it was fun. It was joyfulness everywhere. And then a strange thing happened once again. Known enemies of our community pulled up in a car. And there were several individuals in the car. And as we stood with water pistols, they aggressively hopped out of their car. 
and they went for their guns, but yet they too had water pistols and they sprayed everyone. They sprayed everyone with water and then they jumped back in their car and drove off in laughter and in joyfulness. And so then we broke out in laughter and joyfulness. But it had happened. The ultimate thing had happened. We weren't just dealing with allies and joyfulness. Enemies began to also join in and spread for two or three years. And even more enemies joined in and joined in. And it was beautiful. This happened for approximately two or three years. And though it happened mostly in the summertime, the joyfulness even spilled over into all seasons. Yet, did I see the killing, the gang violence, the gang mentality return? And yet it was vicious once again. But I and those that witness this miracle, this thing, have a belief that cannot be shaken. So I and we sit for the return of that miracle, for the return of that joyfulness. So then when it does take root in its shadow, so will we water that root and allow it to grow everywhere. And it shall not be cut off. It shall not be deterred or turned away from prosperity. And this day shall come and I will be waiting. So will we all. Yeah. They have infected our blood. Our blood system is infected. They have infected my blood. They have infected my blood. They have infected all of our blood. Yeah. I have seen them at work. Work, work. They go inside the blood. Inside. And place metal. Metal. Foreign metals. Metal. That have an effect. A negative effect. Of our blood system. Our we blood. have been infected like guinea pigs. Uh, All of our support systems were yet infected. Infection. They are blood invaders. Blood invaders. But I have come. I have come. To reclaim, reclaim victory. Reclaim victory. I have come. Yes. To lift the banner. Lift the banner. And to let all. all that know. Everyone. And all that don't know, all that don't know, that safety eyes. is here. Yeah. Fear no evil yeah. is on the way and here. Yeah. I shall claim victory, victory and reclaim victory. Reclaim victory. And I do it yes. now. <sighs> These blood invaders have infected us with disease. Oh, no. And with guilt, guilt. And with sin. sin. And with sinful acts. Sinful and murderous acts. thoughts. Murder. They have contaminated our blood. And our waterways. And our airways. Yeah. But I have come. And Ooh. I have straightened them all out. Ooh. And we shall. Uh, sit, sit. Upon the victory. Ooh. For. Ever. O oh, Romeo and Juliet, somewhere out there art thou. The people knowest not, but I have summoned you both for your love, addiction, and self entitled affliction. There was no trace of thee until now. I shall connect your dots and plots together. No longer shall you play to the ears of your audience, but ye shall be on stage and in the front row. 
I bear not your words, but your herds have I heard. The crumpling of leaves have formed a crumb trail to their hearts, and I increase their pulse as one. Never has there been such an audience captivated. A video of the great escape seen by many witnesses before and after. No agency of any sort knew of anything nor anyone. It is only believable because they are all together. One backs the other's words and the others become one truth. A circle of trust as the world turns. It is said that it takes two to tangle, but I alone have danced the night away. In the year 1600, I spoke to a man from my interface. He wrote about me, and he went and told the world about my gleaning. <laughs> he is going to change the whole earth and all of the universe. You watch and see. Listen. Listen, uh, listen. Stop staring at my face and look at what's inside of me. You need to listen to the words that are coming out of my mouth. Yes. They don't want you to know the truth. They don't. So they, they don't. introduce you to lies. Lies. But lies. all you have to do is ask the lie. Ask, are you telling the truth? Are you? And the lie cannot deny. No, listen. No. I'm going to tell you what they want you to do. Mm -hmm. They want you to go get a job. Mm -hmm. Go to work. Mm -hmm. Retire in about 145 years. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Work yourself to death mm. and get the saying, man, I love you to death. <laughs> That's the lie, man. You got to love a person to life. What about that one, that, that, there? And though I joke with you, I am still telling the truth, brothers and sisters. Brothers and sisters. This is not a revolution, but it is a resolution. In the days and nights of my dreams, I see and hear all that is to see and hear, even before it comes. Before one of my latest dreams, where I was sleeping, I was awakened by an old woman who entered my home through my mailbox. This is what they do. The aliens, the, ape, the ghosts, the demons, the devil, the devils. They come through the cracks in our homes. And as my mailbox is open and is connected to the inside of my home, it is a perfect entrance. She came in. She was an old white woman. Older. Oh, I approached her as I woke up from my sleep in the dream, but was in another dream. And I approached her. I said, hey, hey. But I said it calmly in manner. And she, well, she turned into a man and then quickly into another man. And this man was tall, and he was a white man. And the first thing I remember saying is, Oh, you're an alien. You're an alien. Looking like Elvis Presley. But he did not look exactly like Elvis Presley, but he reminded me of his posture and of his personality. So I said to him, What are you doing here what do you want what do you want and he looked at me and he said to me he said oh, I'm in pain my body is falling apart and I looked upon his body and he showed me marks there they were bloodshot filled with blood wounds that came from illnesses and in the day of his fierce thing and even some Looked at like marks, and as something that came from fighting or arguments, oh. I said unto him, I said, God heals all. 
and I am God. I am God. And he looked at me as if he did not believe me, and he said, What? And he showed me his wounds again. And I said, Behold, God heals all. God heals all. I am God. I am God. And then he looked at me again. He was confused. But I showed him. I said, you can be healed, but you fight against me. Hear me. And this is, this is why. This is why. Your marks will not heal. And I grabbed his hand. Boom. And I separated his hand and his arm from his body. And mine was separated from my body. Mm. Though I was looking out of other eyes in the spirit. And I showed him as if we were tussling, arm wrestling. I said, you fight against me. And this is why your wounds will never heal. And then we were back together as we were seen from the beginning. And he just looked in amazement. But he knew I told the truth because I showed him, even outside of his body. And he looked confused. He was confused, but he knew the truth. And he wanted to deny the truth. And he looked down, not at me, but down on himself. And then I remembered as I awakened into this reality that these beings these aliens they are many they are here they are coming they all come there is good in them Good. There is bad ones. Bad ones. But nevertheless, nevertheless, God rules over all. So when I tell you what I have said, this is true, true and truthful statements. There is not one lie in it. I tell no lie. Nothing but the truth. Truth. And these are foundations that are being built. Yes. And being told and foretold right here on my town. And this goes out to all those that listen and follow. And all those that believe. And all those that don't. Listen. There is only one path and you shall see it. One way. There is only one God and you shall see him. I am he. God heals all. And I am God. God.